June 19th, the Big Green Bus visited Piedmont Biofuels Co-op in Pittsburgh, North Carolina. It's a worker and member-owned cooperative that has several locations in the area processing waste vegetable oil into biodiesel, which is then sold to its members. I couldn't place windows open While we were at the co-op, we met with Tim Inger, who gave us a tour of the facility and described the process of making biofuel. A fat is a triglyceride. So you have a glycerin backbone right here and three fatty acid chains. The catalyst that I talked about outside is going to attack the bond right there and split apart the fatty acid chain from the glycerin. And this fatty acid chain doesn't like to be apart from anything. It, it always wants to be with someone else. So happy to leave what was my home. I uh, I learned about oh god um, the chemicals that are used to put into the to the veggie uh, to act as a catalyst to remove that glycerin. I had known that there was a chemical mixture, but uh, didn't actually know what went into it. So that was really cool. To find out about what they use, sort of how the process really, really works, hands on. I have a new appreciation for the economics of it. The fact that it's really cost a lot to make and I just... I learned why they priced it above diesel, which seems kind of silly to me, but hey, I'm not in the business, so... Minimize the water. Okay. The more things that you can make, if they can use that, the harder